I gave my credit card to 13 of my closest family and friends to give me these right here. And in this bag is 13 different MLB jerseys. That's a lot. <laughs> Each one of these jerseys is going to have a random team on it. And depending on the team that we pull, we'll have to get a player from that specific team. But real quick, it's not going to be that easy. Because instead of me actually picking the players, the wheel is going to pick the players. Our goal is to build an absolute super team that could win the World Series. And if we fail, there will be consequences. Which one do I like? Let's go with this one. Let's see. Number one. Oh my gosh. What do we got? Baltimore. Okay. Not bad for the first jersey. Let's go. And just for fun, as we pull these jerseys, I'm going to be putting them on this MLB jersey tier list. I'm hoping that we get a bunch from in the fire category. I think we started out hot with the Orioles alternate. I'm going to go clean for that one. But here we go. What player from the Orioles am I going to be getting here? There are so many things in this wheel, good and bad. What are we going to start with? The back of jersey. Okay. I didn't even look who's on the back, to be honest. What do we got? Oh, Adley. Hey, Adley. Welcome to the squad, baby. Jersey number two is... Oh, my... Okay, that is for sure Atlanta. Again, back to back super clean jerseys. Now, this one's got Acuna on the back, so please wheel. Let me get Ronald. Honestly, the Braves blue jerseys are one of my favorites, so I gotta go fire for that one. But here we go, Will. Whatever you do, back of jersey, back of jersey, back of jersey! Highest war! We should still be good with that there. Coming off an MVP season, Ronald better have the highest war. And unfortunately for me, Ronald Acuna Jr. is not having a good start to 2024. Coming in with a .3 on the war. But the player with the highest war on Atlanta happens to be Marcel. Ozuna. Hi, Marcel Ozuna. Welcome to the squad. Next one up, what do we got? This? Okay, this could literally be anything, pretty much. What do we got? Oh, Kansas City! This is a W, especially if we can get Bobby Wood Jr. And honestly, I think the Royal City Connects are super underrated. So to be honest, that might have to go on fire with Atlanta. It definitely could go in clean, but I think it's got to go on fire. I love that thing. Now, the big question is, will the wheel do a fantastic job and give me the only guy I really want from that Royals team? With that being their star, Bobby Wood Jr. Jr. Please, Will, whatever you do, Bobby Wood Jr., come on, come on, come on, yes! Back of jersey. Now, I have not looked at the back of the jersey, so we're gonna reveal it together. There's no way it's not Bobby Wood, though. Three, two, one! There we are, Bobby Wood Jr. In the first three jerseys, we got Bobby Wood Jr. and Adley Rutschman on this team. We're honestly cooking right now. Let's keep going. Next jersey up, let's go! Oh, God, that was a mistake. <laughs> I can see it though. We got the Arizona Diamondbacks New Jerseys. Even though the new Diamondbacks jersey isn't technically on this tier list, it's still pretty much right here. This one's pretty much the same thing. And I'm gonna put this one in good. But Will, what Diamondbacks player are we gonna be adding in here? Again, we got Zach Gallon. We could possibly do. We got Corbin Carroll. Most doubles. Let's see. Who do we got? Wow. I should have known Kittel Marte. I actually love that pick. I'm down for that. So Kittel, get over here, dude. Next up, what the heck do we have here? Another like cream deep backs looking jersey the only one that really comes close would be like the ranger city connect i'm pretty sure and oh look i do love the city connects though i like this jersey i'm sure there's going to be a couple that i don't like but this one big fan that one had Corey seager on the back too and honestly i would not mind adding that dude in here i think the city connects got it going clean and we'll we meet again i really don't want to do this come on dude please no no oh yes yes please i'll do that all day and we're gonna help round out that crazy good infield with Corey seager of course now all the that we're missing is a first baseman. Next jersey up real quick. And if it's a National League team, everybody's got to like the video right here. Let's see it, baby. What are we... Okay. How, how the heck did that happen? Okay. What do we got? What the heck do we have? Oh, Dodgers. The Dodgers one, obviously so iconic. And there are so many good stars on that team. I'm going to be going in clean with this one. And we'll please Mookie Betts, Shohei Otani, anybody. Oh my God. Yes. Yes. Most expensive. I wonder who the most expensive player on the Dodgers is. It was always going to be two time MVP Shohei Otani, the modern day Babe Ruth. We're about to hit the halfway mark on the jerseys. And the next one is. Oh, that's got, yeah, that's Phillies for sure. Personally, I like the powder blues more, but the red's good too. I think the red has got it going good. Not one of the best jerseys in baseball, in my opinion, but still very good. The only guy that I really want from the Phillies has got to be Bryce Harper. So come on, wheel. Most expensive again. I did not expect this to be so close on the Phillies, but Bryce Harper beats out Trey Turner by $300,000. But we got our first baseman, baby. Bryce Harper, get over here, dude. Rapid fire the next one. What do we got? Oh, the City Connect for Cincy. I knew it the second I saw black and red. I am a jersey nerd straight up, but I love these jerseys. I don't know what to tell you guys. This one's hit or miss for a lot of people, but they're clean for me. I want Ellie De La Cruz, so we got to get either stolen bases or most popular players. So come on, baby, please, please respin. There we go. But please, Will, I need Ellie De La Cruz in this team. It would be 
be so perfect. Oh my God, back of Jersey again. This better say De La Cruz, thank God. Right there, Ellie De La Cruz, welcome to the squad. Five spots left in the next Jersey is another cream colored one. The new Minnesota Twin Cities. And this one I'm looking at, Royce Lewis is on the back of this. For me, the Twin Cities alternate is by far the best Twins jersey, so that's going to clean again. Byron Buxton or Royce Lewis, that's really all I want right here. Come on, come on. Highest overall, that was way too close to lowest. And ironically, the highest overall on the Twins is Duran. I'm scared for this one. What do we got? Is that... What even is that? Is this Cleveland? Oh my God, it is Cleveland. And the Red Guardians jersey is going in good. Will Spin, I really don't know where the heck we're going to go with this. If I'm being 100% honest, random free agent. Honestly, that probably works better. The random free agent, we're going to use our DH pick. And we're going Brandon Belt. So let's add him in. Brandon, let's go. We still desperately need some outfielders. And what do... Blue Jays? I'm guessing what do we got? Oh my gosh, this thing is tiny. Somebody ordered me a kid's jersey. Are you kidding me? I know I look 12, but come on. I like the rebrand despite that being a kid's jersey. Let's just go good. I mean, I don't know. And again, we need an outfielder. And there aren't that many outfielders for Toronto. Most RBIs. So who the heck is going to have the most RBIs? Dalton Varsho. And Dalton, along with Marcelo Zuna, is going to be playing the outfield. And we're down to our final two jerseys. Again, if you guys are liking the video so far, it really mean a lot if you could drop a like and a subscribe to the channel. I'm not doing it. I'm not. No, no, no. End the video. End it now. I'm not doing it. Oh, it's so tough. The green's not bad, though. All right, whatever. Now, the thing I'm really not excited about. Who the heck are we taking from Oakland's team? Highest batting average for Oakland. It better be Brent Rooker. Please let it be Brent Rooker, Abraham Toro. I'm not doing Abraham. I can't. I, oh, my God, dude. The last jersey is right here, and we need this to be amazing. Feels nice. Wait a minute. Okay, here we go. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, my God. A straight up Shohei Otani jersey. The good thing, we already have him on the team. So now there's a chance that we can actually get Mookie Betts as well. What do we got, please? Please, please. Come on. Yes. Yes. When I needed it the most, we finally got to pick. Mookie Betts, welcome to the squad. Look at this team. Mookie Betts, Bobby Witt, Ozuna, Otani, Corey Seager, Bryce Harper, Rutschman, De La Cruz, and... Dalton Bar Show, but still, solid top to bottom. Let's try to win this World Series. At the end of the year, the team almost broke the LB win record at 114 and 48. I was expecting that team to do pretty good. Not like that, though. My God. Awards real quick. Gold gloves going to Bryce Harper, Dalton Bar Show, and Mookie Betts. Shohei, obviously, for the Hank Aaron Award. My boys got the MVP on lockdown back in the AL. And the batting title going to our starting pitcher, Shohei Otani. And going into the postseason, our first stop was in Toronto. Toronto wasn't too difficult as we took them down three to one lcs time versus cleveland we better be strong enough to get past cleveland of all teams and through the first four games of the series we're up three to one just finish them off right here drew come on for shane bieber there we go on to the world series versus nobody other than the dodgers or the wow the cubs well that didn't last long yeah dodgers here we go and we kind of got a problem i got the dodgers jersey on so hold on a minute we can't have that and shohei versus tyler glassdow in game one we got to go crazy we got to set the precedent now come on there we go eight nothing baby but in games two and three we unfortunately started choking and now we're down one two in the series drew i need you to come back here please there we go oh tani come on one more one more there we are and coming back to the trap in game six we gotta put these dodgers away but that's not gonna come easy as the dodgers already are up to nothing and never mind make that three zach Eflin, please there we go he got out of it finally oh my gosh guys this is a horrible game and we take the loss seven to three yo that was okay and there we go. Oh my gosh, Bryce Harper. Thank you. Tying up the game 33 in game seven of the World Series. In bottom of the ninth, down by one. We got to go in here and get this. Speaking of Shohei, here he is. Let's go, Shohei. Come on. The dude's one of the most clutch players to see ropes that into right field. And that's a double to start us off. Tying run at second base, winning run at the plate right now. And one of the best is up here. Mookie Betts, there it is. We couldn't have asked for better. The Rays bring home their first ever World Series. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe down below. Really does help. And be sure to check out this video right here because I know you guys are going to love it. Go ahead and click it and I'll see you guys over there.